Welcome back everybody to Mr. Blue Farms here on Farming Simulator 22 aka Tommy Miller folks as you can see we got a sketchy load of logs here sketchy who loaded this oh wait I did oops but anyway I hope y'all doing all right um, we got this little bit left here and as you can see down through here there's no trees left and we got the ground up to here we cannot do nothing to this one or the rest of those till I buy the land I just want you to see down through here we got all the trees all of them we even took down the one that was right here now, I want to go over to the sawmill, and as you can see here, that's the sawmill, that's the wood chips, and this is the actual sawmill. Now, as you can see, the sawmill is not in a dark color, so therefore, you can't buy it. I don't own the land, I just own the, the sawmill. Um, the reason saying this, let's see, go over here, we'll visit. You know, we got all the planks down here, and we go sell wood. We can't sell wood no more because it turns them into planks, which is a, a good thing. That's a good thing. So, all right, I'm going to come around here, and uh, we're going to go to, I think it's production, sale points. And go to here. It's a little saw, saw, you know. Well, we can put the saw down, but you know, we we don't own the land. So I was going to put this thing. Yeah, I'll do it with the mouse. I was going to do it right here. Let's put it right here. That way, we can bring the semi around back here and going out that way. Then we can sell wood. As you can see, it's uh, looks like wood chips bales of wood and actual trees but I don't own the land that's why I don't like this map so I think what I'm going to do is take this I got and put that little sawmill somewhere on my ground so we can sell some wood let's see production selling points Here's the sawmill. See if we get somewhere. Where's a good spot? Where's a good spot? Tell you what, we'll put it right here for now. I don't know exactly where the trickery is for this. I'm just gonna put it. Hey, well, I'm going to put it just like this right here. We'll probably sell this tree here, too. Oh, we'll probably sell this thing here in a little bit. we got to come back and get that little bit there. Well, folks, I hope y'all are doing okay today. I think I might have already said that, but if I didn't, I just did. I'm seriously thinking about... We got a lot of work we need to be doing, but I'm just really, really not in the mood to play on this map. And when Mr. Blue gets in the mood not to play, things go wrong. Now, I don't know. I'm just. Oh, it sold all up for $7,380. Well, almost all. Should have undone the straps over here oh it's going to always be at one that wants to stay did it fall that time yeah it fell I think got a pretty good reach on it that was $97 for that we'll go get the rest of that come back and sell it and we'll there's two things in this sale thing I want to get 
might well get them now before they disappear. Let me get down here and load these up real quick. All right, I got the rest of that. Yeah, that there, I think we're gonna use that for a mowable area for grass. Cause I don't think too many things can fit there unless we put down like more greenhouses or something. And uh, that's the only thing I can think of. Which I, I do like the map. I just the only thing I hate about it is you can't select the whole the whole areas and stuff and Alright, that's seven hundred and forty six. Turn this truck off real quick. We're gonna go into right here. Use vehicle cell. We gotta use tractor. Thinking about buying. Thinking about. I do though I want this right here. Reason for it, it shows um, it's 25 months on it. It's 25.1 hours, which that shouldn't be too bad. It's 12 cows, 36 pigs, and 38 sheep. But as you can see there, silver chicken star. This holds chickens. Um, I think we're just going to leave it just like it is, folks. Rim color and all, and just buy it. And A to buy. Yes. Okay. And then this guy here. It's 139. By the time I get done with everything and stuff, which we don't want the EU, we want the US version of it. Um, we'll go down to the decals. Decals are green on it. Where you can make them yellow. Uh, GPS, three point, tune up the engine, uh, head limit management, we're not going to worry about, GPS, and that brings it to uh, 196,650. Seems like I'm missing something. Uh, oh, tires we want right there. 202,150, and then we still, it's going to be used. So 202,000. I just don't see myself doing that. I see myself coming in here to large tractors. And, and and we're going on here to the to the dealership. See we got this in here. This is the in game 8RX that Giants put in. And on over here somewhere. Somewhere in all this mix. We have, might be the next set, I could have swore I had it in here. Ah, right here, the 8RX mod. Uh, I think this is by custom modding. Yeah, um. See, we got all these, let's see, that's standard, exact rate, exact rate row crop. Row crop is what we want right now. That's what we want to get. Extra lights. Yes, why not? Triangle, yes. We want the 410 version. Eh, we're not going to do the headland management. GPS is a uh, yes, so. Main color, license plate, and that's it. Gonna be 435,129, folks. Wait a minute. What is this missing? We don't have no weights on this thing. Is this some kind of custom model? Hmm. There's the weight. There's the three point. But if we get those, no weight. And we can't take the EU sign off. I don't think it's custom model. Well, horses for two. And that's all I got too, folks. See what this eight, uh, T8 has to offer. That's just the weights. Okay, we want we want the big weights on there. Light package, rear package, stock. Oh, okay. And then set up 435 horsepower, row crop, rear row crop with weight. I think that's what we want right there. GPS, yes. 
Well, we still. Yeah, oh, boy. I just don't know, folks. Uh, I don't know. All right, folks. I found it. And it's gonna be the eight or I mean the AR. John Deere eight or two eighty five thousand ninety one thousand five hundred options brings us three seventy six five hundred. And as you can see here, we're using the Continentals. It just looks a lot better. That's the Continentals mission. I just don't like the way those look. Back to Continental. And we're number three, 36 inch row crop. Only thing that's changing is the back weight. Yeah, we're gonna go with number three. That's all the weights in the back. We're gonna need them. US design, fenders, triangle, three point engine, 445 horsepower, headland not installed, GPS, yeah. And we're buying. Just hope we don't go bankrupt. It's gonna be our main horsepower tractor. Now, we're gonna go back into the cell. Oh, we already got the chicken trailer, okay. I almost forgot. Now, everybody's planting cotton. So, what I think I'm gonna do, uh, where's the planters? Planters right down here. We need a good planter. I don't know really what a good one would be. Ooh. Seeds add-on mod. Let's see what we got on over here. This is going to take, we got plenty of horsepower for that, but I think that's going to be too big. Yeah, there's something we're looking for right here. That is a 16 row, because when you, when you buy these, you kind of want to make sure that, you know, 16 row, we're going to buy a 16 row head to harvest it. And this is a 12 row, so we need a 12 row head to harvest. And it's on 36 and seven's on 30. Let's take a look at it. Yeah, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, and six at the top. That would be a 12 row. Let's see. A good fertilized set. Um, didn't see no tank. Oh, it's with tanks on the thing. Okay, we don't have no tanks on our tractor, so pesticide set, tanks, liquid fertilized set. Yeah, there we go. Dry for lies. No, I don't want dry for lies. Boy, there's a lot of options there. That's the newer ones, I think. I think what I, yeah, I just need to go right there. That's, uh, tanks plus pesticide set. Liquor fertilized set plus max super. All right, we want to go there. Liquid fertilized, yeah. Uh, wheel brand, does it matter? John Deere, good year, John Deere. Let's go with John Deere. Oh, we can, no, we still can't change those tires up. Working speed, I think nine prior. Let's stick with nine. Uh, front weight. Um, that helps keep the wings down. Uh, it's going to be awfully heavy. Let's go with it. Cleaner disc configuration, no till row cleaners. Uh, why not, right? The rubber tire closing wheels. Uh, disc closing system. Let me see if it kind of, yeah, here we go. I'm seeing that. 
back to Yeah, let's go that this closing system a retire that that I'll just go with that, that's pretty good. Hatchers, trailer hitch. Why not, right? Uh wing support. Oh, okay, it's up there. Oh yeah. We'll go with that, and that's all we got. And we're gonna buy it. Yes. Okay. All right, that's our tractor and planner. Now we need to go to. I don't know if it's going to be in plows or not, but it's. So this. It's got the ripper. And I don't think we'll go with that. Yeah. 12 row 16, 16, 16. There was something else that I was looking at in here. It might have been those. Might have been. Be right back. Alright, folks, this is what I was looking at. It's the Delta Plow, but when I showed it, Hold it up different than this. We probably could use that, but I think we're actually going to go with uh, this 12 row KMC Ripper better. I don't know if it's going to work right. Um, yeah, I don't know. Uh, this would be this for planting cotton. As it is, oh, we'll get it and find out. Let's see, can we go 10 mile an hour? Yep, no drags. Drags, I'll go with ah, that's what those arms are for. We'll go with no drags, make it look a little bit American. Yeah, let's see how this is going to work. 32,000, so. All right, let's go see our tractor. Oh wow, it jammed it up in here, didn't it? Here's the inside, monitors, cool radio. Hope it's got cool air, because it is hot. see that front end come up see how much yeah a lot of weight there yeah this is the type they use around here except the tanks on the top they usually have a tank on the front but and there's the unfolding Yeah, I like that. Let's get rid of that blue box there. All right, perfect. Now what we're going to do with this, I'm the wrong one. Go to here, of course it's going to save. Now we're going to go down here to contracts. And you see our chickens are doing pretty good. Uh, as you can see here, cotton, 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 cotton. We get to point, it's all cotton, except for those. And, um, yeah. Field 25 is uh, almost, I will say 11,000. And 69 is almost 11,000. So that's 22,000 right there that we can get back. See, I'm thinking about planting all these with cotton. 
So X is to accept, Y is to borrow items. And say so that you get this in here, use that planner to be bigger. You know, you only lease the, the, all the equipment for 848 and you can do all the rest of these. But yeah, I had to go the big way. So except, oh, that's COVID. I don't want that. Let's go back here. Make sure all of them say it's cotton. Cotton. And that's cotton. So that's all. Uh, that's all of them. That's, that's quite a few. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I lost count. There's about ten of them there. We gotta get this thing filled up with cotton seeds. Nine hundred for a thousand liters. Let's see if there's any bigger out. Oh. 1900 okay we're just I don't know how much it's going to take but I know it's going to take quite a bit well I'll do eight of them for six thousand oh seven thousand two hundred okay seven thousand two hundred and I hope we'll get quite a bit of money back okay There we go, we're going to set this down, and we're going to start filling. Oh, it's not going to hold very much. A 1,272, oh man, that's... Do we not have animation of the seeds being filled? Well, that kind of sucks, but it is what it is. It's showing we're full and we're on cotton. Uh, corn, sunflowers, soybeans, sugar beet, and cotton. Okay, let's uh, close covers. I'll lift it up and we're going to fold it up. I know we will not need fertilizer because we're going to be doing that person's field in the next episode, of course. Probably February the 2nd. Oh, well, I'll get started on some of them. I'm not going to do all of them on screen. I do think I need another weight on the front of this thing, so where's the weights? Getting uh, down kind of low. Uh, 11. Okay. Oh, I'm going to get the minion weight. Ha. John Deere slice weight. No, no. What is this? Hmm. What does that go for? I don't say. Probably for the bigger ones. Yeah, it's 1800. You're going to be dissing here. Oh. Okay. Oh, it would be. Yeah, we'll probably plant some cotton ourselves since somebody plant so much cotton I don't know it probably wouldn't be a good idea to plant cotton but we're gonna use this to plant beans do we plant beans with this cotton corn sunflower so yes soybeans we can okay we'll hip our rows up on the uh, have our rows hipped up over here let's take a look at this real quick while that's warming up some more yeah we got a ripper shank right here and this right here hips a rose up and you plant on top of those with these things on the back here I wish we could take them completely off most of what we use is this, this right here it doesn't have that on it and doesn't have the ripper on it it just have the hipper part of it but anyway 
There's one other thing I want to do. I'm going to shut this off. We're going to go to our semi truck. And I guess we're going to leave our trailer here. No, leave our trailer here. But before I go get it, I want to see if we can do. So this would be in placeables. And it would be um, animals, chickens, we ain't got very many chickens things to go by, so how much is it, 600, 650, 650 chicken barn by Stevie, Chicken barn, no fence by Stevie. Chicken coop, 360. All right, we're gonna go chicken barn by Stevie. 650 chickens. So let's uh, oh, let's get this zoomed out. Let's get us turned around here. Yeah, see, that's what I'm talking about. It's hard to place other buildings. Let's see if I can rotate that, what it looks like. I think that. I think the eggs will come out on this side here, the way it looks. And we'll have to feel from this side. Please don't let it be a mess up. We're going to put it about right. Let's do it about right here. And then about. Right here we're going to put another one. Hopefully. Okay. Go over here and look at it real quick. Yeah, the eggs will spawn there. We'll dump wheat here. And this is the open door. Okay. Oh, you open both doors. Hmm. Okay, don't know what all that says. Close. Oh, whoa. Oh, open the things up. Okay. Close that door. I'm stuck. Oh, there we go. Ah, here we go. That's where we're going to buy our chickens. But since we got the trailer, I'm going to go to Animal Dealer. Probably be the next episode and get chickens for these um gotta see how much wheat we got might have to buy some wheat for them but yeah um so yeah there's one more thing i want to buy but hang on a second all right folks we're just going to get this small seed tender here there are bigger ones but for right now we're just going to get this little one and um, well brands we're just gonna go with uh, BKTs they look pretty good oh 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 no go with wide tires yeah okay um 22,000 Going once, going twice, and sold to Mr. Blue. Alright folks, let's take a look. We we got the seed tender, we got a hipper, we got a planter, new tractor seeds, and a chicken trailer. Well I think it's our old fertilizer. I forgot we had up here. But yeah, you're gonna unrealistically bring this over here. You put your seeds in it. There it goes. Kind of, sort of, yep, right there. 
see the seeds going in. To be around a thousand. There you go. It's only six percent full. Oh, we can. Yeah, we can. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven thousand, and it only holds twenty-two. Yeah, that'd be good. All right, folks. In the next episode, we will be doing some planting. Sorry, it's not in this episode. I just got to get my noggin, my brain working, and um, we'll go in here and we'll show you on the map all the fields that's blinking. Field 25, I think. 27, 30, 46. So there's oh, oh yeah there's none up in this area that's flashing so you got two here three four five six seven eight nine ten ten is that right uh we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yep, we got ten. Ten contracts. Oh, it tells right there on the side. Duh. Okay, so ten contracts to do, folks. Oh, I forgot about this. I forgot about this. The baler. The fifth wheel, because this thing is not working right. And the little B6405 is going to go bye-bye also. So let's go ahead and sell this on this episode. <clears throat> uh, we're going to repair for $29. Yes. Then sell. We'll get $22,028 off of that. Uh, $6,196 we repair. We'll get $6,205. Sell that. And repair the baler for $33. Got 18,327. So, yeah. That way, y'all know those are gone. And, uh, we still got 4,078, or 478,164 left, folks. So, yeah, next episode we're going to be planting and getting some chickens. And getting this to our shop. So, till then, folks, I appreciate each and every one of y'all for your time, support, and and watch and comments and liking and subscribing and all that good stuff y'all just awesome and uh thanks to the new ones uh i've seen a couple new ones in there i haven't seen before on the comments so i appreciate that y'all and uh you know use the way i do it y'all watch my video and oh i'm going the wrong way whoa you turn yeah, watch my video and leave a comment, like, and stuff like that. I will go in and leave a comment and a like and watch your video. Now, I may not watch it, but it will get played in full. Because a lot of times I get behind and stuff, and some of them I'll watch. You know, sometimes I'll watch them if I can, but if I'm really behind, like if I have a fire or something, I just have to play them in full while I'm doing fire reports or stuff like that you know but you will get a play and pull if you leave a comment so folks till next time y'all have a great day a blessed day and I'll see you in the next episode hopefully bye oh about which one